Hello everybody, it's Vertical Sandwich. We just defeated Jack of the Greed and now we have to find our way out of the maze. In the last video I said that, that was not going to be an easy task. It's actually going to be a reasonably easy task. Uh, the only reason I didn't do it was because we still have to go to the Hall of Heroes and... Ugh, jeez. And it just wasn't going to... It wasn't... We weren't going to be able to keep the video under 20 minutes. 20 minutes is about my upward limit for a reasonable video. I very rarely make videos more than 20 minutes long. Oh yeah, there's a guy there. We don't need to deal with him though, really. Okay. So what we do have to do though is move these pieces around. Um, they move like actual chess pieces move, so we can only move the the rook. Uh, no, go go back this way. We can only move the bishop on diagonals. Should be able to move him by hitting him with our sword. There we go. Really, get, get off the bishop's spot, buddy. Okay. And once they get to the piece that's the same color as them, they will lock into place. Which is good. But they do move around by themselves, which is kind of a pain. Now, rooks only move uh, along the horizontal axis. So. Usually do the hey, Kingy McKing get on your space. Uh, Queen's gonna be a problem. Now the Queen and the King can move in any direction. And there we go. Access out of the maze with the chalice. Oh, we probably could have kept it under 20 minutes, just barely, maybe. Oh well. Time to go into the Hall of Heroes. Back and forth like a supernatural yo-yo. Maybe the master will make it harder to find those magic egg cups. Unlikely. They're pretty easy all the way up to the last level. Okay. We on the second floor now? I believe we are. We are indeed. Alright, we got the spear from her. We can get... He will give us a shield. He will give us better arrows. He will give us an axe. It's reasonably handy. Um... Let's go with this. Fortescue. You are back on the battlefield, yeah? This is good. People say to me, Sturngard, what do you think of this sword or that axe? But I say to them, NINE! NINE! Mountain warfare is a question of science. The science of shields. <laughs> I think maybe you should take my shield, yeah? It is magic, Herr Fortescue. Some say it is better to have a magic sword than a magic shield, but I say to you, this is rubbish! So long as you use it properly, the shield will make you invincible! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Alright, gold shield it is. Fantastic. Best shield we're gonna get. Um, now, I'm not fantastic with the shield. I'm going to tell you that. In fact, I rarely use it. We will, uh, there are areas where we're going, going to have to. Now, oh, the, the asylum. The asylum is, I think, probably the only place where uh, you get, I think, less than 1% for killing a monster. That's how many monsters are in this place. It's so ridiculous. It's just a constant onslaught. Yeah, you can see I'm all the way up to uh, the entrance hall at this point. Uh, it's just a constant onslaught of obnoxious monsters. Horrible. All right. Yeah, it's going to be all about running around and timing. 
We are gonna use, but like, we're gonna be lucky to get through this alive. This is the only place I've ever game over in this game. <laughs> Yeah, because these guys will get hits in when you're running past them. Oh, we can daring dash through them. It's not helping, but... Yeah, it's so nasty. Uh, down we go to do this some more. And now we have cannons shooting at us, which is exactly what I needed. Okay. All right. Yeah, now this becomes a big problem. It's ridiculous. But we get we get past this. It's it's not even about getting past this. It's about getting past this. Stupid bats. Ah. Oh. Cuz I needed that, right? I mean, this is just sadistic. Oh, we needed that so bad. It doesn't really matter because the things that are coming down next are going to be harder, so... There will eventually, I believe, be access to, like, a fountain. Yeah, so now it's these guys. Incredibly hard. They run right at you. Whoa. And notice no life refill. Okay, now we have these guys, and these guys are a little easier to deal with. Mainly because they don't have arms. Ugh, jeez. I'm going to continue to run in a circle, by the way. It's, it's a slow strategy, but it's a safer strategy. And I'm hoping that eventually what will happen is there will be some sort of life refill for me. Now they're eventually going to add zombies into this mix. Okay, good. Two of them. Oh, awesome. Oh, that was a lot of damage to take from one zombie. Ugh. Man. This level, I'm telling you. Okay, we're not done yet, apparently. Alright, there we go. This, I believe, is the last set of things we have to kill.
We are going to have to kill those guys on the other side, though. Oh no! Oh man. Holy crap, did we barely make it through there? Oh jeez. Thank God for the fountain. I hate that level so much. Everything after that is just a it's a cakewalk, people. By heck, am I glad to see you. That Zavik tried to force me to hand over the shadow artifact. He means to release the demons from their tomb under the enchanted forest. But I said to him, I said, You can't touch me, you lanky windbag. I'm a mer. Aye, that told him. But then he had me locked up in here with all these nutters. Oh, it's been terrible. I haven't managed to get a word of sense out of anyone in weeks. <laughs> right. Well, I'll see myself out, thanks. You have a good look around, lad. Xarex left some stuff lying about that I think you might find useful. Alright! The Dragon Gem! We have two of those now? We do indeed. Two is all there is, so... Uh, I believe we're good. Doesn't matter, we're getting out of this level anyway, even if we're not good. I have the chalice, and I'm alive. That's all that matters to me. So, uh, I believe what we'll do, if the next level is the Enchanted Forest, I actually believe we'll probably take arrows. Or whatever that guy's got. Oh, Danielle. I've got something here I can give you, but I've no idea what it is. Do you fancy a little gamble, no? Flaming Longbow! So, uh, that's actually going to come in useful. Which is awesome. Uh, yes, we will leave the Hall of Heroes. Okay, what I'm going to do, we're going to stop this, and uh, I'm going to go to the... Uh, I'm going to go to Cemetery Hill and uh, refill my life bottle. And then, when we come back, we will, uh, we will, uh, we will tackle, I guess, I think the Enchanted Earth is our next deal? I don't know, I'm gonna have to look. Yep. Alright everybody, I will see you for that. Bye.